Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. We're back with some ladder leverage. Cheers. We got Mr. Wasubi with us. How are we doing today, sir? Hey man, I, I am glad to be back. Thanks for having me. And yeah, I mean, I, I felt like revisiting Skyotel after a long time. <laughs> yeah, that's mostly what I've been playing. That's the thing that I got like the most MMR with was Skyotel. Yeah. It's just, it's, it feels more like Nilfgaard than Nilfgaard does <laughs> with oh, all yeah. the damage and stuff. It's like, yeah, Nilfgaard yeah. got kind of weird this patch, but I mean, it's still fun, but um, I, I, I'm really oh, liking Skoya. Yeah. yeah, that's why I enjoy Precision Strike, right? Like you've got some control tools, but you, you're still lock, rocking all of these engines. So it's like a nice combination for laddering, especially. Yeah, when I first seen how the cards were going to function with, you know, like, Gezra's and Gaten, like, everybody... I was hoping that Guerrilla Tactics would, like, be yeah. really, really good, but I just knew that once I seen how these cards were going to work, like, Precision Strike, it was going to be the way to go, or the Elves. Immediately giving you three bodies is just really strong, right? Yeah, especially with these guys. But, yep. um, uh, this is a Green Knight creation, so shout out to Mr. Green Knight for... Uh, making the list um, and so this, this is uh, like as you guys can see there's no heat wave there's no justice and we're playing waters and ethna instead you know making some use of the devotion um, another thing is that we don't have oak we're actually playing etril murliga instead of like oak and two garbage for provision bronzes which is nice um First of all, Murlega has the beast tag if you ever get to play her together with the water. And also, it's just like nice removal, right? Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I love, I, when these cards first came out, I loved them. I, I, I still do. I think they're great cards. It's just there's some cards that are better. Mm -hmm. But in a devotion list like this, with, you know, all the chip damage you have, you know, you can take out some serious. Yeah, stuff. exactly. Yeah. Mm hmm. Especially with like the leader or like, you know, your Gaten does some damage and then you can... And also like the funny thing is you're playing so many engines, right? So like your opponent actually needs to remove those. Right. Which might lead to one of them surviving and then empowering the other, right? Yeah. Like I think we had a game where Murlega was insane. We yeah. also had a game where we utilized the seven damage for the, from the Etrial. But yeah, I... I quite like this setup overall. Yeah, yeah, and if in the mirror, if you can, because they see this etrial on the board, and if they have their dryads on the board, they're gonna be like, "Well, I gotta kill this," and then all of a sudden, yeah. well, all your other stuff lives. So that works out pretty well. It um, lines up nice. Too. Yeah. Yeah. I'll. I'll. So the list is uh, like a, a consideration version on the website. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, so still check it out at, uh, at teamleviathangaming.com slash meta for the, you know, you can import it there and just make some changes. I'll also put the link in the description, you know, for this, the straight thing. But um, definitely check out TLG. Some good stuff coming if you don't make it to the end of the video with, uh, uh, you said Larocco and Saber are going to make Yeah, Larocco and Saber, they are teaming up on an article. Uh, it's basically written in the form where like Loraco interviews Saber, kinda, but he's basically just uh, Saber himself is answering questions about what it takes to be a pro player in Gwent. That's Absolutely. more or less like the theme of the article. Yeah, shout outs to Loraco I... too, man. He's been tearing yeah. it up this season, man. I mean, tearing it up just out of nowhere, man. <laughs> I guess that osmosis to... effect, you know, from hanging around with everybody, man. But he's he's yeah, doing mean, like, really, really well, man. Really well. So you know, the the competitive seasons are starting again. So a lot of players are returning with, uh, you know, they're just motivated to maybe have a crack at it in season three. You know. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. Shout outs to him, man. He's having an amazing yeah. season so um I could also give you guys like a quick spoiler i think the article will be released on monday as well which is like the day of the leather leverage video right yeah. so i'm not sure if it's already released like 3 p.m ct usually when you publish the videos but uh it's gonna boil down to like three key factors right which is time commitment mental strength and decision making skills yep. 
these are basically like the three things they go over in detail. Yep. And then you just go full Bart mode and play 1,300 oh, yeah, games. <laughs> games ignored. Shout <laughs> yeah. out to Bart anyway. Like, oh, dude, dude's he, a machine, man. Well, it's like all in good fun, right? Yeah. But uh, yeah, so, you know, obviously, if you want to go pro, you have to commit a lot of a lot of time to a lot of games mental strength you know getting tilted never a good thing and then decision making skills you know yeah. basically boiling down to like matchup knowledge etc etc absolutely so yeah definitely a good read coming yeah. soon tm on the website so stay stay tuned for that guys for sure yeah so we'll have a couple games today uh, probably a couple other games uh, later on in the week um from this little session we had mm. we had some serious like clown games uh i don't know what's it, happening <laughs> though like i i think i think you're at like 2500 right like, I'm, I'm at 2493 which for me that's pretty good yeah. i mean i'm like you know i'm not the greatest we're, we're, we had some we had some weird games let's just put it that way <laughs> like yeah. i will I, I i hardly played any monsters but i will say that like as long as I'm like, we got a lot of blue coins too, which really hurt. Yeah. But um, I, I will say that, like, right now, Gwent, the way it should be played, feels like Scoyatel. Like, every game should feel like you're playing, like, I don't, just the way the cards go, the interactions and stuff that go on. Like, <laughs> this is to me how Gwent should be played. Like, you got yeah, some it, it engine, you got nice, some removal. Right? It's yeah. chessy, you know what I mean? Like, it's just got that, <laughs> I don't know. I just, I'm really loving it. I think it's great. Yeah, I I think it's a very good thing to point out because, like, the deck wants to set up its own engines, then it can start removing the opposing side of the board. And, like, also the sequencing matters a lot with all these jumping cards, etc. The positioning matters. So I actually like the chess comparison a bit. Like, yeah, yeah. definitely a difficult deck to get the hang of but uh very rewarding once you actually understand the ins and outs of it for sure and you can also oversworm so be careful of that um oh yeah <laughs> yeah but uh, like always guys thank you so much for watching here's a couple games we'll see at the end awesome. hey oh. asking you will receive sir speak out I can barely hear like over the sound of you drowning. Yep. All right. So we got a oh yeah, guys. Okay. So if you're wondering, I was just uh, asking for a lockdown matchup. <laughs> 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 Might sound crazy, but um, yeah. So we keep uh, the witchers. What about the mm -hmm. Um. Got the chills. Maybe maybe we can uh, mull one of the cat witchers actually. Just try to look for uh yeah that's good. That's good. Keep it here. Probably the hand, yeah yeah yeah. It's looking very bronzy with the crucial goals in hand, I like that. Do we play the waters or no? Um that's a very good question. I think we try to save it for the bleed. Because we have to get the ball out of him, right? True. So we're just flip, Might flip matron. Sound ambitious. Yeah, sure. Flip the flip the lamp, flip the matron. It's just gonna get locked, right? It's a no guard gameplay. Yep, lock. <laughs> or uh, you know it too well. You uh, might have attorney uh, joust. Yeah, I mean, depends. Depends. If it's the usual lockdown. I don't think they actually run Tourney Joust anymore. Mm -mm. Just the enslaved it's one. Just like a uh, full, full, full lock. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Okay. Uh, so now we get our are, ladies you, out, huh? Yeah, all craters seem very nice. Because now we also have a rebuke target. Like, if we get the death blow, we get a plus two. So that's really nice. Yeah, doesn't seem like the water is necessary. Next I don't understand why is this major like allowed to get value, like why? Because like, he wants he that extra not... proc for the lock, but he just he... oh yeah, <laughs> whoa! Any Wait, what? Any boosts it for us? 
What is it you want? My man, you can't play what you can't play Roderick in round one though. Like Roderick and like, Drew Love couldn't have been hurt, but who would love such a freak? Okay. So he gets an oak critters that doesn't everyone has their secrets. Oh he goes matron everyone too. So we just rebuke it. Um that's a good question. Probably yes. I like it, yeah. Yeah. Sure. And, and the funny there. thing is, even if we need to rebuke again, we can just use the Folvey, because look, we were talented enough to draw all of our expensive natures. <laughs> right. Coal, council, waters, everything. He did is it in again! Half. Yeah, I mean. Her grace will not be pleased. Uh, I think at this point we play the Cat Witcher front row, though. Next to the matron. matron. Yeah. That way he gets boosted and then comes back. Get double engine value. Ah, that's, that's not really the hit we're looking for, but right. it's fine. Hunting pack. Yeah. The doggos. Why doesn't he play it front row, by the way? Oh, uh, sorry, back row? Like, to get the matron? Like, <laughs> I just don't understand. Alright. Uh, I guess it's just pyrotech time, right? Yeah. Uh, have you seen a fuse lying about, yeah, have you? Like, what is, uh, does he just, like, not have locks, or what's the issue here? Let's just save him for all the... the gezzers yeah, and stuff. Yeah, uh, but... that, uh... Whoa, Joaquin, too! Oh, okay. I, um, I have to admit, I, uh... Oh, there's the lock. <laughs> yeah, just gotta make it a big lock, that's all. The has the um, so now I we... guess we run the Pyrotech, see if we can hit the Sergeant or or the Bradens. So we're hitting we're hitting the button. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Oh, the worst one. Well, actually, it is the worst one. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. So we're going um, five. Or are, we taking is, the gaz or are we taking the gate? And... Yeah, we could also drop um, council for a sentry. If we get a sentry. So that's where we're at? I think that's better. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No Try to get sentry. If we don't, we did. Okay, didn't get a... Uh, etrial. Kayam! Yeah, so we just play this. If the matron gets boosted. And then, uh, yeah, we still can play the gate, and if we have to... Ideally, we would end the round with Falvey, but unfortunately... Nice! Oh. Wait, that what? What?! So he played his walking... Oh. So his My hand is just Ball, played. Usurper... Jesus Christ. <laughs> Robins, Roderick, oh, field guard players, man. Ah, I don't That's know. That's a lot like, of commitment to just give up, right? Like, yeah, we didn't play like, anything. We played bronze. Yes, like the bleed is gonna just crush. The game is just over, right? Yeah. This is a keep, right? Matron's not doing anything. Uh, well, so wait. Ah, okay. Since he locks our leader ability, my question was if we actually keep that, right? Yeah. Do we ever get uh, it off, though? Yeah, that's that's also fair, I guess. So we just so, I mean, we waters. just... Uh, so, ah, we don't have that many tags, unfortunately. We only have... Uh, one, two... Well, one. <laughs> just, the, two. just the Witcher, right? Ah, uh, this is really unfortunate. So we could call for a tag, but that's not very good. But at the same time, we kind of forced to punish him. Problem is, like, we play the Ethna, he just plays Ramon. Uh, crossbowman kills one token, then he kills the other token, and we don't get very much value at all. So, we so I think just playing the order. Yeah, just playing the order. Probably should have went back row if he has a pikeman. Uh, yeah, as you said, like, the hand is not really working out in our favor. So is he a soldier friend? 
Yeah, yeah, it's uh, it's a lot, right? Should no. trade up. Oh, okay, it's Argent, sure. Well, I guess we just slam the Witcher back row, right? Hopefully. I mean, I don't know about this. Like, if we don't bleed, we just. Everything dies. Well. I mean, the uh, Ethne's gonna get some value, but. Ethne is really good in, like, a short round. Yeah. That's why I wanna potentially, like, just top deck into Ethne with, like. Okay. Alright. Um. Could rebuke that, the one with the armor, right? Might as well, huh? Yeah. Nice of him not to play depot, actually. Very kind. <laughs> right. Oh, you gotta get that greed, man. Yeah. Um. What is this Fove? Like, he doesn't have any more double deploys, so we can just Fove uh, rebuke. Ah, there's it's no only rebukes. temping. Tempering. All right, all right, Tempering. Yeah. Yeah. Invo! What on earth is going on, man? Uh, so now the gate and procs the fledglings again. But it's a very weak gate and right? Um, I am kind of confused. The Don't Merlega we just slam one. the Ethna? Don't we slam the Ethna here? Just slam the Ethna. Go like full day review, go gate them, and he's word. dead, no? Uh, yeah, especially like, if one of those goes up front. I think he's gonna need like. Yeah, I mean, he he just looks dead to me, like, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm missing something, but he, he's disrespecting this bleed. So like, way too much. Now, right? Yeah, 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 just full day. Could review to one of the fledgling, one of the twos. Um, uh, yeah, like, I don't think. Oh boy. Oh. Well. That's, uh, that's a lot of pew pew pew. He's yeah. got no lock. Yeah, I, I, I don't know what he's doing at this point. Like, so now we just landed. gate. Yeah, and also, have you noticed how he's stacking front row for our Gezra? Yeah. <laughs> like, I mean, okay, but it's true that he can always lock it, right? But... 36. Ah, of course. We got unlucky and hit the ramen. Twice. Uh, twice, yeah. But, such is life. What? Okay. Well, Strike good back. luck uh, catching up to these Gezra points. Like, uh, so this is basically an 8 plus 2, 4, 6, 7. 15. No one if plays. You oh, the Igni, we played around it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not another Igni, man. So that's 12. Wait, he doesn't. He can't lock it. Oh, strike what is that? Guy? Oh. Uh, <laughs> it's just sadness. Like, I don't understand. There it is. Mr. Opponent. Sir, I'm going to refer What's you doing? to uh, Mr. Saber's channel, the, the council yes. over on YouTube. Not on play. If you're looking play for a play the lockdown deck. <laughs> yeah, that's not how you do it. Um, yeah. Carapus. This yeah, was that's high the, time to pay the, the plan B, huh? <laughs> this is mm -hmm. where we're going to go. <laughs> I mean, Carapus is not a great matchup either. Uh, we'll see what we can do here. Drop yeah, the I mean, Sentinel first. The, the Brig has to go, yeah. Uh, do we want the tempering? Not really right not really so yeah. we stay here okay. so we, we have rebuke four way we have the move package yeah i think this is fine seems seems okay so we still just start with the dwarf uh or is it too slow um well we could just start with the matron flip the lamp if we want to because it's a dryad uh, but if we if we ever want to play the water we can still go for that. Yeah, this is probably okay. Let's see what happens. Um, it gets a bit of a jump on the dominance. Really, Cape Troll off. All right. Yeah, I mean, yeah, he's just gonna slam the Siri. 
Um, can't really deal with that, right? Question is, how do we get out uh, in two cards? Because if you play Siri and Yird and Yghern, that's like 21 points with one leader charge. Right. So we would need to only make, what, 21, so that's 28. So we need to make like 19. Uh, that's a lot. <laughs> yeah. Um, I mean, maybe we just drop the oak critters. Get the matron rolling a bit longer. Yeah. Uh, so... He basically has minus two. So he's at five, we're at 15. Then we just need to get ahead of the uh, Yghurn. Yeah, there's Siri. Oh, I sense trouble. Um, now we just have to make sure. Ooh. Okay. So we go Witcher, back row. Um. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, like, I was thinking about maybe, like, rebuking the cave troll, and then we can, like, threaten the Siri, but he's not stupid, right? Yeah, he's yeah gonna I'll just use a charge. Yeah, exactly. Um, playing go. something like, uh, uh, it's a problem, right? Yeah. Could go with the Witcher, yeah. Back row, just drop right? it back row. Yeah, I work for the queen. Ah, <sighs> problem is... Got that Alright. Mm -hmm. So he might have to waste the charge. I mean... Yeah. Does that get him there? Okay. Does this start pass? Another, another engine comes down. Is this where we pass? Yeah, so he basically plays two cards. Then he draws a card, so he still goes a card down. It probably is, honestly, yeah. Uh, he shouldn't have allowed us to stay up. Get out. Yeah. Yeah, he, sh he should have played something back row for, like, a Adrenaline Rush well, or something. Well, if he plays back row, we get the Witcher value, but I, I see what you're saying, yeah. I mean, maybe he didn't draw the Eagern, right? Which is very lucky for us. I, I just didn't really know what to play there, right? I was thinking maybe Miner uh, instead of the Cat Witcher, I mean. Uh, or maybe like Falve, Rebuke on the Cave Troll, threaten the Siri with like Leader or something, I don't know. Sure. So he wins on even. By one. Uh, didn't have to use a Leader Charge, right? But the so longer now... we go, then we go down a card, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, now we just have to deal with the Keltulas, basically. So we keep the Pyros, or do we drop? Yeah, keeping one. Keeping one is fine, yeah. Uh, just ditch the Miner, I, I guess. Uh... Woo! Yeah, that's, uh, that's good. <laughs> Still have a Rebuke, right? Yeah, mm. Rebuke and Tempering. Uh, Yghern. Drops the Yghern, yeah. So we just start with the Sentry? Uh, I'm thinking if we have to defend the Bleed with Waters, probably do. So start Water, so... Uh -huh. The question is, do we want to go front in case we call for Gaetan? Ah, yeah, we have to call for uh, Gezra anyways, right? Right. Oh. Yeah, probably back row is fine then. Yeah. My name. I don't recall you. Sure thing. It really is a, just a... If you don't have the right answers for it and they draw the right yeah. cards, it's a tough deck to play against, oh boy. Oh yeah, it is for sure. 
definitely have to leader charge this, right? Yeah, rebuke and the leader charge. Mm-hmm. Beast is a while to grow, for sure. Right. I mean, now he's pretty much out of threats. The only real threat is Skeletal is herself. Which obviously is a big threat, but... So now where do we mm. go? So the sentry plays as a 6, it's not enough. Which is fine, I think. Just uh, develop the engine, see how he reacts. If he passes, sure. Then he has a possible brick then. I don't think he passes. Well, yeah, I think he always wants to play the Andrega warrior here. Just to consume the fog lot. He could also just thunder or parasite this, yeah, sure. But I mean, that's bad. He's just giving us... Uh, the even. He's just giving us another way... Like, the the fledglings will get progged by an elf again, right? That's what I mean. Um. So what now? Fall into... Well, it's not great, right? Just drop the dwarf. Yeah, dropping the dwarf sounds nice. We then get a chance to hit the Eagern. Yeah, sure. Why not? Yeah, I don't think he passes. I mean, we're offering uh, offering him the pass yet again, right? Uh, really? I mean, if he just uses a leader charge, he probably was in good shape too. Or he goes Barg Heist. Bargast, okay. So he wants to play as well as well, potentially? Really? Wow, is that greedy. Yeah, I mean, well, he went on even cards, right? And he saw Oak Critters, so he probably knows he, we don't have Heat Wave. Do we tempering uh, this? Mm, probably, yeah. I don't see why not. So fall of tempering. Gets him to head. Yeah, I like it. Just talk to strangers. What are we tempering? Uh, oh, the power of never mind. The dwarf, yeah, but don't use him, right? Yeah, because it's just in his. <laughs> yeah, then we're super sad. Uh, maybe wait for him to actually consume it and then. Uh... Yeah. Ah, uh, does Do they look run... like he. Did they run. They run vanilla Geralt, don't they? Uh, not really. They run like he already played the Wrath, and then they run like a Heat Wave, and that's it. But uh, yeah, there's a Ray Rush. Wow, <laughs> it's going big. <laughs> yeah. Um. So we drop our Pyro now. Yeah. Now. Not well. Then he, he gets to just play Kelly without any threat whatsoever. Um, I gotcha. But maybe that's fine. Uh, so what well, else could we actually do? We could just play the... I think we will call for Ge uh, Gezra later. Uh, so the actual place for nine. Yeah, I guess we just use the actual on the Bargast. I've been on your and then to get ahead, we also use the Pyrotech. Yeah. Uh, probably plays the Kaltulis now. Uses a leader charge. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he's just uh, he's just going all out, relying on the Osral finisher. Eh, not sure if I like. It. Whoa! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's all in. Um. So, if we play Ethna place for aid basically then we need to play another card do we ever survive a short round three 
car down against Ozrul. Uh, I think we're fine. So yeah, I would just play the Ethna in the back row. Yeah. And then we can call for the... For the Gezra. Yeah, he's gonna eat these tokens. Well, we get one, it's gonna proc one, right? Oh, yeah. Unless he kills one of these with, like, uh, natural selection or something. Well, that would, like, spawn two tokens on his side of the board. Yeah, okay, it's just not like that, sure. Sure, he's playing units that are not really units. <laughs> right. Basically just staying on the So now we count. go Gezerus and... Uh... Oh, yeah, we, we, we call Gezra for sure now. Just uh, slam him on the front row. Get the boost. Uh, this game is kind of lousy. I'm not sure. No point in showing you. No point at all. Yeah. Now basically the token is blocking the... Uh, and we have two more nature cards to come, right? right. So it's like kind of nice. Heat wave. Yeah, immediately heat waves. That's like to be expected. Playing around, Forest Protector. Okay. Uh, so we can just drop the council, right? What are we pulling? Uh, uh, the gate? Well, we do have a... No, no, no. It's only Dwarf Dryad or Elf, oh, right? Oh, that's right. So we do have... Um, an Elf. We do have both an Elf and a Dwarf, yeah. So the tags don't really matter. I mean, let's just roll it, see what we get, and then we... Okay, so we missed the Matron. Uh... So I guess it's just a uh, minor? Yeah, that's Is there any reason to roast that? Matter, use one leader charge maybe? On the Foglot? Just to stay ahead? Yeah. Okay, perfect. So he passes? So, well, yeah. I mean, if he has Ozro... Well, he has an Aromancy, uh, so he automatically gets uh, he it. Used it on the, he used it on the Kelly. But yeah, he's using the Ozro as well. He's going all in. Squirrel. <laughs> oh, it's Squirrel. Okay. Ah, that sucks. Because we have to use our last good gold. Oh, that's so lucky from him, man. To have this... Okay. Well, that sucks. He had the perfect uh, bleed hand, right? He didn't have the Ozro in it. Yikes. Alright. Uh, now we just probably lose to the Ozro. Yeah. Yeah, because he still has a hero. Yeah, well, he used both, actually. Oh, he did? So he has yeah, to he draw pulled, it. Yeah, he, he pulled the Kelly, yeah. Oh, yeah, he has to draw it, but I mean, like... Well, we're still stuck we got our bricks out. <laughs> so... so. I mean, like, this is... So we drop the sentry first, huh? Yeah, I can go sentry, front row. Front row? Mm-hmm. Don't we want to when go... we gate on it to the back row, it will boost everything else, basically. Oh, okay. But yeah, our, I think our problem is that the leader is actually dead. Uh, so I'm wondering if we're supposed to keep the council and use leader, forest protector, maybe. Yeah, he'll give us a leader, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, yeah, so Ozreal is a 14. You see? Yeah. Okay. So you played Parasite, right? Mm hmm. I mean, if he oh. has another special. Oh, okay. So we actually do get a leader. So we play we? Gaten and. Yeah, Gaten hits it down to four. We're actually one short. <laughs> it's Aww. just a nightmare. Yeah, I mean, we can play the Gaten, yeah. Uh, but, like... Unfortunately, ah, if we actually have uh, killed the Seriously? cave troll. Yeah. Do we kill our own unit? Or it's uh, the same thing? No, we, we can't, we can't. Yeah, it doesn't work. So, I mean, you just pull the two... Ah, oh, that's such a shame. So he wins by one. Ah, uh, he... Well, Ozra is a 14, so we actually win by one, but... Uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, he didn't oh, draw it! Anyway. 
You didn't draw yeah, it. Yeah. Yeah. Too much. Too greedy, I think. Too greedy. Yeah. We gave him a bunch of. Gilgamesh uh, XL. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's funny. That's uh, that's the ladder leverage for this week. Wasubi, like always, brother. Thank you for recording, man. Um, anything new coming from the website? Nothing really, since nothing new's well, coming. there out. is. Um, there's actually going to be an article from Loraco and Saber on uh, what it takes to actually play Gwent professionally. So that's an interesting one. There you go. Yeah, if you want to yeah. get on uh, get on one of the opens or something, that's something to get into. Yeah. So keep an eye out for that. Um, like always, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, thanks to Green Knight, too, for the list. Uh, we appreciate you, sir. Yeah, um, definitely an interesting spin on it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if it could take out Kelly, that's pretty good. Yeah. But... but uh, <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.